Hey everyone and welcome back to the Armstead Family YouTube channel. Today we have a special update on the room swap that we did. So in a previous video on the Minimalist Home Tour Part 3, we showed you our kids' bedroom and then our third bedroom, which was a nursery slash soon-to-be office. Well, we went ahead and swapped those rooms and we're excited to share that with you guys. But before we get into the video, if you've been enjoying this channel, please hit the subscribe button and hit the bell notification to be notified every time we post a new video. So the reason why we made this switch is because the room that we're sitting in right now, the new office, was previously our kids' bedroom. And we had these awesome floor beds set up for them, but they only wanted to sleep with each other. So they had an entire half of the entire room was not being utilized at all. And so what we decided to do is, hey, we wanted to have our own office set up for our videos, for some of my music, and also for just working. We wanted to have a room where we could just work. And we wanted to set it up really nice, really minimal, have that really cool feel. So that's one of the biggest reasons why we went ahead and switched their rooms around. And now the room that they're in, which was previously our office space, now they are fully utilizing the entire room. So now they're having fun, just playing in there, and they have their one floor bed that they're sleeping together on. So. That's the reason why we wanted to go ahead and switch the rooms up. So the first part of the setup was getting the right paint color. So we wanted to go with white and there are so many different shades of white from so many different companies. So you got Benjamin Moore, you've got Sherwin Williams, you got the Bear Paint from Home Depot and Valspar from Lowe's. So it's, how do you, how do you choose the right one? So I did some research and I found the right white color and I went for it. So we can put a link in the description to the blog that we went to to find the right white color for their room because they're all different and they have a different purpose. And Carlene, she loves white. So that's one of the reasons why we chose white. <laughs> I like white, everyone okay. knows it. The next step was the desk purchase. So we wanted to have a really cool wood look and we didn't want a ton of storage space as you see in a lot of different uh, desk setups. So we wanted to keep it real sleek, real minimal and real clean. And we ended up choosing this L-shaped desk that we got. And we were gonna go with the smaller desk, but we saw that for the same price, you can get an L-shaped desk that's almost twice the size. Yeah. And not that we wanted to take up a bunch of room, but we saw that we could utilize some of the desk space to store some items, which we don't have a lot anyways, but it gives us an opportunity to go ahead and make full utilization of the room that we're in. Mm -hmm. And here's a screenshot of the actual desk on Amazon. If you'd like to go ahead and purchase it, you can go ahead and do that. And we'll put the link in the description below if you would like to get the same type of desk. Next up is the chair. So we wanted to get a good chair that could provide some support to our back, but we weren't gonna go and spend like four or $500 on a super ergonomic chair. Though I really love one, that's just not really what we, you know, we need to do at this point. So we went ahead and picked this chair. What's cool about this chair is it only took me like 20 minutes to set up. It's super easy and it doesn't take too much time. And not only that, it's a pretty affordable chair. And as you can see in this screenshot, we did not have to pay a ton of money for a decent chair. So if you really want just a minimal chair for a minimal office setup, something pretty simple, simple and light, then go ahead and pick this chair. But if you'd really like a super ergonomic chair, there's obviously more expensive ones. And if you need more back support, uh, then you may wanna check a different, different chair that's a little bit more pricier. Next up, we also talked to you about in a previous video that we got a whole new lighting setup. So you can kind of see the shot looks a lot crisper, but here are the lights. And these lights are the newer 660 LED panels as well as the newer ring light. And we also bought a soft box to go on one of the newer 660 LED panels to make a softer look and disperse the light a little bit better. We're not gonna go too deep into the actual tech specs and a full review, but this is just a, just a high level look at what we purchased. And if you'd like to purchase that or look more into those lights, the link is there. It's a really affordable solution for LED panels if you wanna buy them. 
There are much pricier brands, but this one really gets the job done and you definitely wanna check it out. But if you're just here, just looking at the office setup, this is what we use to light our videos light my music videos, and just light the room in general if we need some light. And also, you see my piano set up, super sleek, simple, and we're trying to keep it nice and clean so that it's not cords all over the place. We actually currently have, inside the closet here in this room, we have some bins that we're storing a lot of the extra cables that we need for the tech. And yeah, we wanna keep this room nice and open and clean layout. Only use the cords and only pull out the cords that we need at the moment that we need them. So in another video, we'll be showing you what we did with the kids' room because obviously we swapped them and it's completely different layout now. Um, and also, I think, did I mention in a video here about the big surprise we got the kids? Mm -hmm. Well, Instagram saw the big surprise. You guys have not. And that big surprise is in their room. So we'll show you guys that one in another video. And tell us in the comments what you love most about this office setup and maybe what do you wanna see more of? What can we explain more of in this office? How we chose the things that we did choose. So, and if you love this video, smash that like button and subscribe to this channel and we will see you in the next video. Bye.